If you're planning to attend any of the Inauguration Day events tomorrow at the State Capitol Complex, you better get there early. For the first time, getting into the Capitol is just like getting on an airplane at the airport. Chief Political Correspondent Mark Davis joins us now with more on the new security system there at the Capitol. Hi, Mark. Hi, and good evening, everyone, from the Hartford Newsroom. State government and the state legislature resisted for years the calls for tougher security at the state capitol complex, but now it is fully in place and tomorrow is the first big test. Over the past several months, airport-style screening of visitors to the state capitol complex has been phased in. It's similar to courthouses and many other public buildings. Just like at the airport, no weapons of any kind are allowed. One man was sent away today because he had a small penknife in his pocket. It doesn't matter who you are. You are subject to search, unless you are a state lawmaker or legislative or state government staffer. Opening day of the legislative session usually sees one of the largest crowds of the year. And this year, there will be the added importance of the governor's inauguration for a second term. There are only two public entrances to the complex. This one at the west entrance to the legislative office building by the state armory, and the west entrance to the state capitol building itself. I'm afraid it's going to be very difficult. I, these uh, security here does the best job they can, but to bring people through one by one like this when there's hundreds of people, I can't imagine how there's not going to be a backup. Many others that do business here every day told us the same thing, but were unwilling to go on camera for fear of making waves. The most frequent word we heard was nightmare. The 30-member state capitol police force, along with a small army of security screeners, most former police officers, are tasked with making this all work tomorrow. We're going to have all of our manpower on. The entire department will be here, uh, making it as speedy of a process for everybody as possible. And it's not just Inauguration Day, Opening Day, that draws big crowds. I mean, starting tomorrow and next week, the various legislative committees start having public hearings on various proposals. And depending on the issue, like for guns and things like that, real hot topics, hundreds and hundreds of people can turn out at the state capitol. So if you are coming, uh, remember to bring your patience, and especially tomorrow, make sure you dress up warm. You might have to wait outside for a while. Live from the Hartford Newsroom, Mark Davis, News 8.